escaped it. All right, so I got some new lawnmower blades here that I decided to install on the 42 inch Arians lawnmower using the lawnmower lift that is shown here, available on Amazon, 60 some dollars. And it works pretty good, though you will notice I had some rope, uh, heavy duty rope attached to it and a beam above uh, to ensure safety. And uh, that's kind of an important thing, folks. Uh, you'll notice this thing has four wheels, and uh, I didn't feel so hot about it just rolling around on me, uh, supporting all that weight and being underneath it. So we used the rope, and uh, no injuries, um, I will report. But all right, let's get into uh, other safety that happened during this. All right, so we use these uh, pieces of wood as uh, chocks, basically, to stop it from rolling behind you also see that uh, important thing to do is disconnect the cable that leads to your spark plug uh, to ensure that you do not uh, inadvertently start this up somehow uh, while you're in there you're also going to have to disconnect the um, uh, the wiring that goes to the headlights and uh, basically ended up taking the uh, the hood off of the lawnmower. From there you could get to work you'll need a uh, 5 8 inch uh, wrench or a box wrench in this case which worked better. Uh, the longer the better because of uh, you're gonna have to put a lot of torque on it. There are the dirty blades from underneath and here's a little video. Uh, you will need a flathead, um, flathead screwdriver uh, to prop in there to stop the blade from moving. And in this case, I had a, a crappy uh, wrench that wasn't long enough, so I had to go back and get another one. And there you go. You see these in there. Uh, make sure you install them uh, in the correct direction. Um, and that led to uh, some additional work for us, which uh, I wasn't all that happy about. And there is the, uh, the finished product. So good luck to you. Be safe. And uh, take care. Please like, please subscribe. Thank you.